this actually happened yesterday, so it's perfect that I procrastinated with my video. I meant to do it weeks ago and um, just put it off. And yesterday I was with my mom and we went to go get haircuts. She goes to a Korean hair salon and it's cheap and they do, you know, pretty good cuts for 15, 20 bucks. So um, I was like, yeah, sure, I'll go. And um, so the lady was cutting my hair and I figured, you know, she does great cuts. So why not um, maybe get a couple highlights too? She says, oh, okay, so just some natural highlights. Yeah, yeah, okay. And um, I haven't done anything to my hair in a long time. So um, we're talking virgin hair here. So uh, she started putting the highlights on. And, um, you know, I was super excited and waiting. And then she takes the foils out. And she was like, oh, yeah, it looks so good, this and that. And I was like, oh, great. You know, and then she's drying out my hair. And then I see this brassy, goldish, coppery, orangey color. And so this was just a perfect topic for me to cover. And um, even looking it up, uh, people kind of nicknamed it uh, Asian orange hair. So... Basically, that happened to me, and for any of you guys, guys or girls, who have attempted to do anything to your hair um, in making it lighter, Asian hair apparently tends to turn orange or brassy, as they say. Um, and I've had that experience before. I've done it. I've tried to lighten my hair myself just for fun, just for highlights, you know, nothing major. Um, and I've had my hair turn horribly brassy, and so I thought I would be safe by going to the hairstylist, but apparently, um, you know, she specializes in cuts, and so she felt really bad. Um, I asked her if she had a toner. She didn't know what a toner was, and so I just asked her, you know, what volume did you use or what kind? She used a 20 volume or something like that, and I'll post pictures or something to show you guys what it looked like. Um, anyways that it looks I asked her uh, did you just put bleach or you know did, did you use any color no just bleach okay cuz yeah I, that's exactly how it looks that's I just wanted to confirm that so I can tell a color specialist what has been done so long story short I made like an emergency appointment with um, a stylist that I've been going to for years it's just that you know it's pretty pricey and anyways she fixed my hair um, which it's the way it is right now so she basically just uh, did something with a low light to counteract the orangeness coloring your hair um, is I think it's okay if you're going for a darker color or you know something simple like that um, but when it comes to lightening hair, especially for Asians or half Asians or Hoppas, um, I feel that we carry whatever, you know, trait of, I'm probably like really botching this right now, but whatever makes our hair turn that color. Um, that's why I feel like I will never not only attempt to do it myself, of course, but then go to someone who may not understand uh, the anatomy of the hair and how color works either um, and I suggest that you guys don't either and if you already have then you probably completely understand um, the situation that happened yesterday so it was pretty funny so yeah I looked online and I've read a bunch of articles on Asian hair and written by hairstylists and people in that industry and Asian hair comes in all different um, textures and uh, levels of coarseness and darkness. Um, unlike a lot of people say, you know, Asians tend to have um, thick and dark hair, which isn't always true. There's so many different kinds. And then when you're Hapa, it's just, it just adds on to that. We have all kinds of different hair. And, um, but they did say that it does tend to turn brassy and orange when you try to color it lighter. And so, yeah, it's just kind of crazy because I've, seen some Korean programs and K-pop videos and stuff and, and you'll see 
um, these K-pop stars with the brassy Asian orange hair, and it's like, what the heck? You know, if they're a star and they have money to go get their hair done professionally and that's not an issue, then, you know, I, what is that? Do you guys know? Like, what is that? Why? You know, and it, it was just, me and my mom were laughing about it, how um, the hairstylist lady was like, oh, it looks so good. And we were kind of joking around, like, yeah, maybe to you. And so it was kind of funny. We just laughed it off. My hairstylist was laughing. And um, she was kind of joking about uh, how her and the other stylists at the salon have this joke where every time some kind of uh, box kit comes out, like whether it's uh, the ombre kit or the highlight, do-it-yourself highlights kit with the little spork-looking thing where you just oh, you just drag it through your hair and you just magically have these awesome salon highlights which can go terribly wrong. And uh, so people always come into the salon and ask to have color corrections. And so my stylist was joking around like, yeah, I love it when those boxes come out because it gives me business and it gives hairstylists business. So she's like, yeah, thanks to the box kits and do-it-yourself kits. So yeah, kind of funny. Um, so yeah, I just want to see what your guys' experience with um, hair color and, and that kind of stuff is. and um, Yeah, so that is all. And thank you again for having me back. And um, look forward to connecting with you guys. So, bye. What?